moment. We are fired up, we aren't taking any more, and we are here to let the powers that be know that not only do we care, but that we also vote. Not only do we vote, we also pray. And we beseech heaven and beseech you that you will talk to the legislators and uh, those persons, men and women alike, will come to the conclusion that there must be less guns in the hands of the citizens of our city and our region. Thank you, Lord, that this is not about political positions, but this is about people whose lives are being torn apart. It's about race and poverty because you look at the victims all across Philadelphia and all across our country. They look like me and majority of you. And I look around today and I see the pictures of, of people who have been killed by guns and it's just heartbreaking. This is my cousin Janora and he was killed in North Philly around his way because he was defending his sister. And they shot him up several times and he died. He was 24 years old and he was shot yeah. seven times over a parking space. I don't think it should be guns at all because once they get licensed to other people, they use them for bad reasons or they get stolen and people die. Like, they ain't killing older people, they're killing younger people now. As gun control supporters rallied loudly on the steps of the Capitol, a group of Second Amendment rights supporters quietly set up displays inside and lobbied lawmakers one-on-one -on -one against more limiting gun control laws. It, it wouldn't help the, the situation in Philadelphia and Pittsburgh. It'd have no effect. We don't need more laws to control guns. We need laws that we have uh, enforced. My children's father was shot, was shot because some parent turned their child over to the street. And we want to blame it on the politicians, and we want to blame it on lack of police, and we want to blame it on lack of education, but education starts in the home. It should not be that a teenager can get his hand on a handgun before he can get a hand on a textbook. In Philadelphia and Pennsylvania, the gun laws are just really too lax. No one is safe until we're all safe.